News, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Amnila Entertainment TV. Today is the 23rd of August at 2022. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow. And so, guys, our President Emerson Nangagwa said e passport bio enrollment centers in the country will be increased to 14 next month. Currently, e passports are issued in Harare, Blawayo, Gweru, Shitungwiza, Wange, Lupane, Bedbridge, and Murewa. Writing in his weekly column in the Sunday News and Sunday Mail, Nangagwa said the ultimate goal is to have a facility in each of the country's 59 districts. He said, Our eyes are now trained on the availability of passports and other travel documents, both to citizens here at home and to those living in the diaspora. Through measures we have now taken, I'm confident all the rights and benefits related to citizen documentation, as promised by Chapter 3 of our Constitution will be efficiently met and delivered to our citizens. The measures we have taken included introducing e-passports which are cheaper and faster and which incorporate international features and standards as recommended by the UN. A couple of months ago, the president opened the e-passport bio enrollment center in Murewa. He said, as I read, seven other centers which include Bedbridge, Wange, Blawayo, Lupan, and Gweru, among others, are already issuing e-passports. By the end of September this year, we expect the number of such service centers to rise to 14, with the momentum being maintained until all districts are covered. We are extending such services to Zimbabwe's key embassies and consulates in countries where large communities of Zimbabweans living abroad are found. Already work is started in Pretoria, Johannesburg and Cape Town, so the large community of Zimbabwean immigrants living there will be saved. An e-passport contains an electronic chip which holds the same information that is printed on the passport's data page which includes the holder's name, date of birth and other biographic information. The document also contains a biometric identifier. All of these features are designed to protect citizens from identity theft. And so guys, that's the latest here. Banyazi my e-passports. And so as it's all in the comment section, remember to like, share, comment, and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that you do upload here on this channel each and every day, each and every hour. Bless up.